Mm. So hello, um, it's me Chief Archon again. Um, I'm just going to be um, streaming a fairly short one today. I'm just going to go and have a look at Mirage Isle and the uh, new way that it is at the moment and see what's available. I find nice new splash screen for two, uh, one point two. I'm just going to go into Mirage now and we'll have a look and see what's available. <laughs> well, that's good to know. So when we come in, uh, one of the things we find is there used to be a portal just here and they've actually put in a more um, useful place which is down there so you don't have to climb all the way up the stairs to get to this one which is good okay as so we come in here um, the this is the um, Windsprung Mount uh, saddle. This is the this is the mount. This is the one that allows your mount to uh, have flame on his feet as he runs. So that's a Lord's coin still, which it was before. Don't know much about Lord's coins. I must confess, these are warped Griffin Guard uniform, and that's Lord's coin still. So that's not changed. here right these are guild stars a hundred guild stars by imperial uh, human uh, humans level design these used to be newest tiers before um, and now oh hi Ferk hello hello <laughs> yeah these used to be newest tiers before and now they are guild star Very nice. Oh, very nice. Okay, so here before they uh, before 1.2 patch, they used to be the um, mineral water, but it's not here now. So it must have moved. They must have moved it. You don't. So mineral water doesn't play a part anymore then, huh? Wow. Oh. There's a thing. Right, okay. Well, before here, there used to be uh, a number of chests. Now there's only two. Um, let's see what prices they are. This one here is uh, seven gold. 
Um, I believe it was Gilda Stars before, in fact. Could be wrong, but yeah, it's seven, seven gold now. And that is a superior storage chest. I don't think that that can be... Mm, yeah, I think that might be the uh, 50 slot one. Uh, this must be the 10 slot one for free gold. So that's good. It's not a bad thing at all. all right, let's have a look, see what we've got here. Ah, this is interesting. Now, mm, actually, this is very interesting because before, so before these um, rego uh, these armor forms, they used to be the actual item, but they're not anymore because it says here armor form design, which means yeah yeah so before when it used to be 20 guild stars these each of these used to be 20 guild stars you actually got the item so all you needed to do then was just place it and um it was already made but now you've got to go for all the hassle of making it interesting but it's only it's only 10 gold now rather than 20 guild stars so it's gone down in price. I don't know what I'd sooner, to be honest. I think I'd sooner have the pre-made one like I do. Um, okay. Um, the Regal Anvil design. That's 10. So each one of those, these is 10 gold now. But it's the design, not the item. This is a new one. The Salvage Forge design. Um not 100% sure what it's for no, <laughs> yeah I suppose so uh, this design is required to make a salvage forge for your house uh, different forges are required to uh, salvage weapons armor and accessories but the same design can be used to build any of the three types of forges so you just buy this yeah yeah indeed and that will be 10 gold each. Um, this is the Regal Carpentry Workbench Design, again 10. Okay. Uh, the Regal Handicraft Kiln. This is the Handicraft Kiln here. Very nice. What have we got behind ourselves here? Uh, this is the Regal uh, Cooking Tools design. Very nice. Ten, ten gold. Well, each one of them are ten gold. Uh, um, this is the this is the Regal Alchemy Table. This one is a difficult one, really, because I don't know what this one is, because it, it's still in Korean. Uh, they did warn us that they hadn't bothered um, with this patch um, making us wait until they'd done the translation. So this is something in Korean. Um, ten gold like the others. And um, hmm, let's have a look. Well, they seem to be able to make um, musical instruments. There's some paintings at the side here, so that could be interesting. Hmm, okay. This, is, of course, is the printing press. Very nice. Um, okay. Of course, these regal ones, they're special because they can go in your house. And um, they can make things that are higher quality than your average um, crafting stations. Um, though there are a few crafting stations of equivalent level in the world. So it's nice to have one like that right inside your home. 
But now it's not a case of just buying it and plonking it down. Now you have to make it. I'll have a look at those in more detail another time and find out exactly what's required to make them. Oh, thank you. Very nice. What's the heifer? What's the heifer up to? Come on, heifer. Do you still do what you used to do? Right. Uh, show your true fero um, ferocity by storming into battle on the back of a bovine. Now, these ones used to drop the manure that you needed uh, to make the eco-friendly fuel, but I understand there might be some change there. Hmm. Which is weird because they still cost five Gilder Star. This tree, <clears throat> this is the Archim tree, Archim tree that you plant. It costs three Gilder Stars, same as it used to. <clears throat> what it does is it allows you to make certain things that you require Archim logs for. Now these horses, they used to require New Year's Tears <clears throat> before the patch this week. Let's see what they require now. Ah, oh, now it's gold. So they require 10 gold now, rather than 30 New Year's Tears, which is what they used to cost. Very nice. Actually, that, that's, that's uh, an improvement in my opinion. Oh, and the uh, black a uh, saber fang cup only costs five gilder stars so um, releases a black cub uh, feed it uh, battle pet formula milk uh, to turn it into an adult suitable f uh, as a battle pet if you do not care for the animal within 60 minutes after release it might die no it doesn't say what it does Interesting. This is the uh, first house. Once you've, by the time you've gotten to about twentieth level, I understand you should now be able to get um, this house. It's only fifteen Gilder stars, and there have been loads of them being plunked down, even in the Omega server. We're on the Alpha server at the moment. Um, but um, yeah do you want to have a look at this let's have a look at this house for those that are new to this it's not a very big house it's one of those can't swing a cat in houses <clears throat> but it has its um, it has its um, hearth fireplace which allow you to teleport directly to your house <clears throat> and um Obviously, you can put a fair amount of furniture and those workbenches that we were looking at earlier. Um, this is the house that I got earlier. I love this house to pieces. Um, it's still 150 Gilder Stars. The houses don't seem to have changed, do they, in price? Um, stone pack 15, iron pack 5, lumber pack 5. Did it require 15 stone packs before, John? I don't think it did. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. I'm assuming they probably fixed that by now with this patch. No, true enough.